Hey, 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 it's the Keyforge Cafe, and... Oh, we don't need this. Today, we are going to be opening up a display box of Age of Ascension. Oh, I'm so excited to pop this thing open. So, I figured I'd let you guys join in on the fun. And hopefully, we can get ourselves some Mavericks. Oh, let's see what we got here. This is the first time I've ever done this. Let's see how we... Ooh, look how cool that looks. Nice. All right, so we got 12 decks here, so good chance of getting something good, or I hope so. So I guess uh, without further ado, let's uh, let's get started. All right, what we got here. Got to make sure to keep the code hidden. All right, so we have the Hypno Break, Center Scavenger. All right, Dis Brobnar and Logos. Um, Later. All right, let's put this guy to the side. Let's see what we got. Okay. Master of Theory. But no friendly creatures in play. You can archive a card for each of them. Oof. So that's pretty good if you begin the game or if you're uh, at a point where you have no battle state and battlefield. Alright. Do your draw cards. Nice mother. It's fantastic. Redacted. Ooh. Ooh. Alright. So far, so good. Remote access, use a point artifact as if it was yours. Oh, man, two quantum finger taps, okay. So far the amber gain is pretty good. One, two, three, four, four, nice. We got some wild wormholes, titanium librarian, lab work. So this is using a lot of the archive, which is interesting. What else we got? What is it over here again? Uh, Yeah, we got our nice Titan Librarian, which goes really nice with well that. And then also, the very first card is the Master of Theory. So we can really build up a nice archive for some big power plays. So what else we got here? All right, Hexpian, Binite Rapture. Ah, I really don't like this card. You know, I pull it off sometimes, but I usually end up just discarding it. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Hecatome. Destroy each disc creature. Ooh. All right. It's kind of, this reminds me of a little bit of a Rigged Lottery, which I really love. Rigged Lottery, which is the Shadows card that you can basically discard the top five and you get an Amber for each if it's Shadows. So if your opponent doesn't have Shadows, it sucks for them. It's kind of similar. Except with this. All right, Purge up two creatures from discard. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty cool. Destroy just one. All right, nice removal. Some more archiving. Jeez. That's fantastic. Okay, nice. Some key control. Some nice cub. Exhum. This is like looking pretty fun. No, I'm kind of excited to try this out. Ooh. Oh, I love the Screech Bomb. I think this is in Call of the Archons as well, if I'm not mistaken. But that's just such an easy artifact. You just lay on the field and you can just activate it whenever it's Omni. You're just, just, man, such good control. Cool. I'm really enjoying this deck so far. I never had this one before. If you have three or more, deal three damage. Okay. Easy. Ah, oh, nice. Blood money. Tremor. Lollop. The ganger chieftain. The drummer knot. Nice. Because we have some... Do you have some decent play effects? We have some play effects. That's an action, but... Okay. Actually, do I even have plenty of play? This one returns to your hand. This one lets you fight. Play. That's an action. Can't play that again. All right, it's okay. It's not bad. And a uh, nice uh, field removal if you need to just clear that up. Cool. Big go bang, bang. Oh, nice. That's great. All right. Very cool. Let's see if we can get that better. Hypno break. Center scavenger. Nice. All right. Let's uh, keep this rolling, right? see what we got here. Ooh. Okay. So, Siv, Baba Trashcan, Mach Machio, Brobnar, Untamed, Dis. Okay, let's give this a go. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we got here. Ah, oh, nice, a Mighty Tiger. You know, this is actually pretty useful. I've, uh, nice, Mapaka, Jaga, Grasping Vines. All right. They're everywhere! Three, they're everywhere! Oh, that's... 
pretty cool. Nice. I always like having the Rust Gnar because having some any kind of artifact removal. Oh, nice. Two of them is, is super handy to have. Sometimes it's just some enemy artifacts that just change the whole state of play. Having one of these things can just resume it back to normal. Love it. All right, we got ourselves a Nox, a Glimmer, Full Moon, Fang House. Nice. A fucking Lawnmower, Overlord Grecking, Tentacus. <laughs> nice. Got some. Ooh, unlocked gateway. Helpful card, always. It's always good to have that at hand. Tesmol. Oh, sick, and it's on every reap effect. The opponent has to basically. Cool, I don't think I've actually ever had one of those yet. Alright, so far two decks in them. I'm liking this. It's pretty cool. Dust Imp, Call the Weak, nice. Destroy the least creature. I hate Amber Imp, though. I, I hate this so much. I, whenever I have this, I usually just discard it, even if it's... Unless it's really obviously a good move, I hate having this card, because I always end up just doing it to myself. Alright, Rogue Ogre. I'm sure I played it. Okay. So if I have a big field of Brobnar and I'm not planning to play my hand, I guess that could be kind of cool. It's a little situational. Alright, Tremor. Lock the field down. Ugh, I like Lollops. Pony do I have a flex in here? That'd be nice. Opponent loses one. Every fight. First blood. One, two punch. Two of them. Wow. So that's... Well, there we go. It's, an, I guess, a good remove right there. Cool. All right, Civ. Civ Machio. Civ Baba Trash Can Machio. All right. Let's see what else we got here. So, what do we got here now? First Mate Campos. All right, Sanctum, Logos, and Shadows. Cool. Oh, nice. Got a nice cell in the fence. Move one from your... So that's basically... This reminds me of uh, Mother Northell or something from Sanctum. All right. Sacrifice. Ooh. Just blow that up whenever you want. Customs office must pay you one to your artifact. Hey, that's just like the other. Well, that's a creature. Nice. Uh, Red lock. In return, if you not gain one. I have never. I don't really like this card very much. Cause usually when I have shadows, I'm always playing stuff in my hand. I'm not usually using shadows only to reap. Nice. Dusk runner is always fun to have. Ooh, whistling darts. Two of them. Do I have any bad pennies? Let's see. I hope I do. This card's like a nice save, but nice got a Ronnie. Life for life. Knuckles. Ah, oh, all right. Just one. Usually I like having a lot of bad pennies if we have all those whistling darts, but all right. Cool. I love this one. <laughs> you can just use all your sanctum one, one turn if you're in another house. Radiant Truth. That's okay. Okay, three of creatures, different houses. Cool. This is like going to be similar to the upcoming Star Alliance, right? I mean, having the abilities where you gain effects when you have different houses in the field. I like that. I like the courage and diversity. Ooh, two gray riders. It's always useful. Take hostages. The turn. Oh, uh, deploy taunt. Safeguard, whatever you're trying to keep on the field. Okay, some good stuns, hold them back, get some armor, got a nice lion to get the neighbors up with deploy, buff up whoever I want. <gasps> I love Pocket Universe! This is a fun card. I've been able to... I've won so many games with this card and other decks just because the opponent wasn't really keeping track of it, to be honest. Fun. Glad it has this. Seismo and Tingler. That's very useful, holding them back. This card I haven't... It's been okay situational memory trip logos archive card okay is that an art wow it's an artifact oh, two backup copies wild wormhole two titan librarian professor stutterkin and pip pip cut through Ooh. all right nice Actually, keep this in order. All right. 
first mate Campos. Thank you, sir. All right, let's keep this show on the road. What else we got here? Oh, come on. No, it's stuck. Okay. I'll just black it out if you can see it goes. Brobnar Mars, untamed. Still Friedrich of the Bridge. <laughs> That's fun. Come on, where is the guy? Yeah, I'll just rub it off. Okay. Let's begin. <laughs> World Tree, I love this. That every time you play untamed, you can use this puppy. Nice. Papaka Chaga. Light Wolf, stole a hand to the left and start again. <laughs> That's cool. I've never read that. Okay. Life Web. If your opponent has played three or more creatures on their previous turn, steal two. It's a little situational. Okay. Creature of the Flank cannot fight this creature. They're everywhere. Song of Spring. Eh. I, this card I've always just kind of used for the Ambergan. I never really used this to, like, actually get an advantage. Save the pack. Destroy each undamaged creature. That could be kind of cool. If you can pull it off right. Love having regrowth. Always good just to be able to return stuff from your fucking discard pile. Persistence hunting. Exhaust everything. Nice key cheat. Fang house. Two lawnmowers. Love that hazardous. Ooh. That's an artifact, right? Yes. Incubation chamber. Froxum spike. There are no friendly creatures in play. Destroy each creature and not on flank. Ah, oh, I love my Xanthix harvester. That's how you pronounce it. That guy's great. Turn friendly creature to play. Tixel beam buckler. It's always fun. I love mother gun. Mother gun's great. You can just whip out damage on the field so quickly. So if they have like a... You know, some little creatures that are annoying you, like the Amber Imp or something. Oh, this is great. Mine Warp. Two Mine Warpers. Ha! Ixlixi Fix Finger. <laughs> Ooh, two of these guys. So my Mars, it looks like the Mars is the, the, the main house I'm going to keep on the field here. And using that to keep reaping. And then hopefully the other houses are support. All right. Clixel Proliferator. Collector Worm! That's awesome. Nice. Okay, we got our smith. The gain two if your opponent controls more creatures. If I control more creatures than my opponent. Sorry, looking at this through my phone, a little distracted. Flame Wake Shaman. Deal two to a creature. That's good. Quick removal. Nice blood money. Pound. Pound. Lollop. Groak. It's always fun. Gauntlet of Command. That's golden. I love Gauntlet of Command. Nice removal, bravo, and one-two punch. All right. Still Friedrich of the bridge. Thank you. What else we got here? All right. The Lord of Mandeville. All right. See what you got. Mars logo's dis. Poof. Okay. Incubation chamber. Nice good archive effect. Storing your good combos for later. Is that... It's Omni too. So that's awesome. That is awesome. Stormcrawler. Oh, I love Stormcrawler. It's so annoying to kill. Okay. Red Planet Raygun, that's so useful for removal. Amber Conduction Unit, that's great. Because it's just an artifact, so it just sticks in the field. Love it. Yixelix the Dominator, got my Harvester, love him. Sky Booster Squadron, got a nice Mind Worm. Mars needs Amber. Each damaged enemy non-Mars creature captures one from their own side. Love it. Mars first, fantastic. It's always fun being able to do stuff on the turn you play it. Got our fixed finger right there, so our Mars is going to stay nice and defended. All right, let's see what we got. Logos. Whoosh. Harlan Mindlock. Take control of an enemy flank creature until this leaves play. Fantastic. I've never actually had a control creature effect yet. If I put this next to my Dominator, 
that's what we have to do. Sloppy lab work. Let's some good archiving in there. Jar goggle. Ooh. Also a fun one. It's like a secret. It's like a hearthstone secret or something. Okay. Interdimensional graft. That's fantastic. Just take all their extra amber. So if they get a bunch of stuff, thank you. I get all the extra. Standardized testing. Love it. Pip pip. Hexpian. Helper bot. Love this guy. Cutthroat research. Archimedes. Good use of archiving. Oh, Eater of the Dead. Purge a creature on the discard. Ooh. Is that any or is that my discard pile? From a discard pile. Cool. Yerk. Nice. <sighs> Unlocked gateway. Got a nice removal in there. A Tesmal. Nice. Controlling them where they can reap. Got a nice Strek to keep their hand low. Not finished with you. Not finished with you. Ah. Uh, Great. I love these, you know, the, the amber controls. Lash of Broken Genius is so useful. It's like, oh, they're about to do their thing? Dis. Sorry. Cost plus three. Exhum. Fantastic. Shart. And Binding Irons. All right. Thank you, Lord of Medville. What else do we got in here? You know, what I really like when I open these things, I'm looking for like a, three cards in a row. Predictability I really enjoy. Feels like you can uh, really depend on that one card to always be around. You can easily strategize around it. Alright, so we got ourselves a Boris, <laughs> Mr. Cash, Hermosa, Untamed Dis and Shadows. Alright, Quicksand. Cool. Two Quicksands? Ooh. So if I have Untamed on the field, I can just remove their biggest guys. Cool. Ah, Lupo. Nothing that big should be able to move that silently. Nepotine Seed. Love him. Nature's Call. Fantastic. Mimicry. I love that card. That card's come in handy so many times. Either I can get like a removal from them, a steal from them, or even just like get an action that gives me amber. They're everywhere. Ooh. Regrowth. Got a nice key cheat in here. Full Moon. Ah, love this card. Duskwitch. Hi, Snape. Too much to pretend. <laughs> nice. Nah, I don't have any decks with this card. This is such a fun one. Too much to protect. Skeleton key. Little niff. Bone rot venom. After this creature's used, deal two to it. Oh no, my bones. Sucker punch. Fantastic. Life for life. Got two of those guys. Lamindra. Get my things elusive. That's great. Got our Knuckles Bolton in here. Gamgee. Dust Chronicles. Ooh. Spider. <laughs> it ties so easily, though. Unlocked. Oh, two unlocked gateways. That's going to be annoying. So this is a decent control. Keep the board controlled. Although, board controls. Not necessarily the best thing to be doing in this game, because it doesn't really get you anything. But untamed creature, exhum, two exhums. Huh. Call the week, two call the weeks. Hate this guy. Oh. <laughs> I hate this card, and I have three of them. All right. Well, Boris, Mr. Cash, you came with some good surprises, but also you ended it with a sour note for me. Let's see what the other, other guys have to offer. Alright. Come on. There we go. Okay. Oh, I love these short names. Netmaster Shine. Robnar Logos Sanctum. Alright. Martyr's End. Destroy any number of friendly creatures. Gain one for each. Destroy this way. All right, go on. Destroy each Deist creature or gain one. That's situational. So like, well, all right. This is gonna amber for it, I guess. All right, each friendly flank creature. Go oh, hey, two Hadrith's Wall. That's fun. Okay, Gatekeeper is always good to have free markets. Yes. As we all know, capitalism is efficient. 
and having a free market will get you the most efficient way to get amber. Workers of the World Unite. After you discard a Sanctum card, I love this one. You know, this one is like kind of interesting because it's like you'll keep it on the field and then there's this one point where the enemy has a little bit too much, and you're just like, screw my hand, discard everything. Ah, this guy's fun. The Grey Rider. Two of these. Fantastic. Protect the weak. Golden Aura. This one's useful for, as a house cheat. That's why I've never used it to heal a creature. I've always used it to just use a non-sanctum creature. A bond, the armor smith. Yes, a pocket universe. Crazy killing machine. Discard the top card of each player's deck. For each of those cards, destroy a creature or artifact of the card's house. If able. Wow. <laughs> that's fun. Oh, size of a tangler, that's always useful. It's a ZYX researcher. Titan mechanic. Titan librarian. Lab work. Whew, getting a little carried away. Two helper bots. That's fun. That is fun. What's up, Igor? Cutthroat research. Got two of those puppies. But if they have eight or more, it's like. You know, you play this, you're still going to lose. They're still going to forge their key. Rock Curling Giants. Ooh. Iron Obelisk. I haven't seen that one before. Champion's Challenge. Enemy creatures from the most friendly creature. Alright. Smith. Fun. Ogopogo. Little Rapskull. And they said I was annoying. <laughs> Pingle who annoys. That's funny. Lollop. Groggins. Foozle. Two Foozles. Cool. That's great. Drummer Knot and a Calphine. Alright. Netmaster Shined. Interesting. I really like those chill names. Alright, we got four more to go. <clears throat> Let's see what the doctor ordered. Open up some key forge. Okay. Q Claw. Volusius Tenebris Jeweler. Alright. See what you got. I have judgment. Ooh. Print from discard. Really useful. Stun. Potion of invulnerability. Ooh. Make sure your creatures can't get hit. Use it to remove the field or some other shenanigans. Gatekeeper. Ah, oh, Barrister of Joy. This is my favorite. You put this in the field, and it's like so annoying if they cannot remove it. All right, take hostages. I can never really get this to do very much, to be honest. Sir Marrows, it's always fun. But if I have Sir Marrows, then they can't use <laughs> the Joya. Oh well. I'll I'll learn to work with it. <laughs> Protect the weak. Ah, oh, deploy and taunt. That's perfect for the Joya. Got two of those taunt deploys. Deploy taunts. Board in the redeemed. Got two of these puppies. Ah, oh, I love my pocket universes. Char goggle. Bouncing death quark. Whoa! Whoa! We got three bouncing death quarks. Oh, that is hilarious. Neat! Okay, standardized testing. Two of those, wow. Cool. Got three bouncing death quarks and two standardized testing. Professor Stutterkin. Oh, two of these guys. If I load my field with the logos, this guy can really do some. Ah, oh. poke. Igor. Cutthroat research. Pit Lord. I really don't like this guy. I don't like being forced to choose dis. And then I'm just trying to kill him. Spider. Ooh, Soul Keeper. Pain Reaction. Gongozel. Blood Shard Imp. Alright. Yerk. Yerk. No, that, I like Yerk. You know, because like, he, he helps you like, get through your hands so you can start the next turn with a fresh one. And got your last book, a staple, you know? 
a disc staple, exhume, dust in, call of the week. All right. So, your name's kind of long, but some fun stuff in there. All right. Oop, wrong way. Well, you guys trying to steal my codes out there. Although, I guess there's really no big deal right now. I'm going to scan these before I upload it, but it's just... They had on some form, or uh, what was it? Some person who works at FFG, he basically said uh, it's a good idea to keep your codes covered, so I'm just going to follow that line of reasoning in case there's ever an online thing. Because that would be so cool. There's an online official version of Keyforge. But until then, we have uh, the Crucible. Manix, the Prodigy of Freedom. <laughs> Dis Sanctum and Logos. All right. The Spirit's Way. Destroys creature with power three or higher. Nice. Rathe is the Fierce. Ooh, this guy is a lawnmower. I love him. People just run into him and they can't do anything about it. Radiant Truth. Potion of Vulnerability. Love it. Hadrith Wall. Staple. Gatekeeper. Knock him down. Doorstep to Heaven. <laughs> Reset. Each player is six or more. Goes back down to five. That is so useful. Mark. The Mark. What weapon can scar? A being of pure light. <laughs> After Mark, the Merc prevents damage with its, its armor. Capture one for each time prevented. Oh, this guy has the, the guy that gives him... What is the armor smith? Where he gives him shields? That'd be cool. Healing blast. Fully hero creature. Yeah, it's okay. Hallowed shield. Meh. Golden Aurora. House cheat. Nice. Capture. Okay. Knowledge is power. Choose one archive card, or if each archive card you have, gain one. All right. That's awesome. Do I have, let's see if I have any good archiving effects in here. Disdainia. I've never seen this one. Your opponent discards each of their archived cards. You gain one for each card. <laughs> it's fantastic. Sloppy lab work. So we do have some archiving. Prevent them from reaping. That's great. Rocket boots. Nice. So you can just do reap twice with this. Alright. Titan Librarian. Classics. We are getting some good archives, so we can get another... Uh... That's great. Because then... Yeah, this is going to pop off, right? <laughs> so if I just have these guys in the field... These tight librarians and just kind of let them do their thing. And if I get knowledge as power, boom, baby. This is a good combo deck. All right, standardized testing. All right, Professor's Tetterkin, that's good. So if we have a bunch of logos in the field, we'll hopefully do it with the Titans. We can keep drawing and hopefully we can get that Amber Game card. Poke, Lab Work, Hexpian, Get Reckless, Key to Dis. This is amazing. There's like no penalty. It's sick. Because at least with the gateway to disc, or the unlocked gateway, you have to at least do that as Omega. Alright, a fair game. Discard the top card of your lair. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. Scullion. Library of the Damned, Hysteria. Okay, returning creatures to their hands. Love it. Lash of Broken Dreams. Love it. Dust Imp. Works well with the key to Dis. Call of the Week. <sighs> Amber Imps. Hate this card. Alright, people. This is our third to last deck. After this, we have two more. So much trash over here, I have to clean up afterwards. Okay. Rage of Book Village Stadium. Untamed Dis Shadows. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. You're going to steal my cards. Heart of the Forest. Each player cannot forge keys while they have 
more than ooh. I just came back from an event where someone used this, and like the way they described it really confused me. Where they like literally couldn't win. Like ugh, this thing is confusing. I feel like it's gonna cause more trouble playing this than actually getting any joy out of it. Like. If any of you guys know how to use this strategically, let me know, because this thing just seems so confusing. If each player can't forge keys while they have more forge keys than their opponent, then it's just this back and forth. So, like, neither player can win, right? Weird. Okay, Grasping Vines. Great. Let me move these out of the way, because I, I can't even place the cards down. In view. There we go. Now you can see what we're working with. Okay, Choda, perfect. Amber Spine, Mongrel. I love that card. Save the pack. Nice artifact removal. Get back from the graveyard. Nox, cheat. Wow, clever <laughs> pull back from the graveyard. Full moon. Bang house. Wow, that was a. All right, this is pretty fun. Decent. Okay, Ring of Invisibility. It's always a good one. Subtle Maul. Special delivery! Ah, oh, fantastic. Perplexing sophistry. Got a nice purge in there. You know, this card's okay. Don't really like it too much. Got two Umbras. Nice, it's always nice. Life for life. Good removal. Lambinda. Wait, I gotta say this correctly. Lambindra. AMG. Bad Penny. Got a Spider. Pandemonium. Gongozel. Streak. Schuler. Not finished with you. Misery Exploit. Gub. Exhum. Dust in. Binding Chains. And Fuckery. Timmy Imp. <sighs> okay. Second to last deck. What is it going to be? What are we going to get? Oh man, we're getting messy over here. It's getting ridiculous. Whoops. Ooh, interesting name. Okay. So, Z S Horsusk of the Cat Like Dunes. <laughs> Promenar Mars and Shadows. Whoops. Let's get this over here. Put this in view. All right. Shard of Greed. Gain one amber for each friendly shard. For each friendly shard. What does that mean? Forge from Courage. For each friendly shard. I'm going to have to look that one up. I, have, I don't really know what this does. Shard of Greed. Like an amber shard? Shard. Oh, I don't get that. Or like maybe Amber's on all the creatures that I don't, I don't know. All right, guard disguise. Sacrifice guard disguise. If your opponent has three or fewer, steal three. All right, lights out. Like doing the returns. Yatsu gang, Yang gang, Umbra, throwing stars. Nerve blast, nerve blast. Ooh, two lamindras. Bad penny. All right. Got some good evasive in there. Exlix. Dim Rager. Oh, cool. Sample collection. Put an enemy creature into your archives for each key your opponent has forged. If any of these creatures leave your archives, they are put into their owner's hand instead. Sample collection. Exterminate. Exterminate. For each friendly Mars creature you control, destroy a non Mars creature with low power. Cool. Nice shock worm. Harvester. Two harvesters. Two harvesters. And three mother guns! <laughs> so I can just whip out, like, whatever damage, how many, whatever Mars creatures I have in my hand. Three times that I can do the damage to stuff. Alright. You know, for a complicated name, I'm excited to play with you so far. Mars needs Amber. Don't we all? Proliferator, my Glixel. Okay. Collector Worm, Shard of Strength, 
Give a friendly creature plus one power counter for each friendly shard. For each friendly shard. What? There's more of the shard stuff. What am I... Is this a... Uh... I don't get it. Alright, we got our Mugwump. Might makes right. <laughs> Whoa. Wait a minute. You may sacrifice any number of creatures with a total power of 25 or more. If you do, forge a key at no cost. That's an interesting key cheat. Flakewick Shaman. Flamethrower. Pound. Lollop, lollop. Grook. Drummer not cowards in bingle bang, you know this is interesting. I don't understand that shard stuff. Did Mars have a shards card? I didn't notice it. Like, is it like a shard thing for each house? I don't know. I don't know what that shard thing is. Amber shards. Ah, all right, everybody. We have one final. This is the last one. This is it. After this is no more. This is the very last one. All right. What do we have here? Nice Sanctum, Untamed, Shadows. Interesting combination. Okay. Up QWERTY, the trickster alchemist. <laughs> QWERTY, with the keyboard. Okay. Roxador. Only just two and five. Stun the attacked creature. All right. Piranha monkeys. Deal two to each creature. Way of the porcupine. All right. Just quickly give him hazardous. How do you put it on? Very carefully. <laughs> Grasping vines. Ooh, nice Chodakichi. They're everywhere. It's great for just knocking in some damage. Get ready for archives. This is okay. I mean, if they don't have any archives, it's just like a big body. Grove Keeper. Love it. Nice Glimmer. Get stuff back from your discard pile. Full Boon. Get Amber for playing creatures. Darna. So if I have any damaged creatures, I can play her and get some Amber. All right, the Sting. Skip your Forge a Key step. You get all the Amber spent by your opponent with Forging Keys. I've seen someone play this before. It seems way, way too much of a hassle. They basically saved up all their amber and then just basically held me out for three turns. Eh, I'll probably just discard if I come across it, to be honest. Or I could just play it and sacrifice it the next turn. I don't really like that card. Okay, legal distraction. Lethal distraction. <laughs> Again? Are you kidding me? For two is a creature. For the remainder of the turn, whenever this creature takes damage, it takes an additional two... Redlock. Meh. Little Niff. It's pretty good. Dusk Runner. Call me Night Haunter, the Dusk Runner. Call me Who Goes There? And Just the Wind. Ooh, the first thief, a Shadow's Children's Tale. <laughs> That's neat. I like that. Oh, I got two of them. I got three of them. Three Dusk Runners. Ooh, two yachts again, gang, gang. Throwing star, nice miasma for Tim Investors. Seraphic armor, meh. It's like completely lame. This is the rare card in here. What? <sighs> All right, stunning creature, Prince Derek. It's ability, gatekeeper, take hostages, smite, shield justice, protect the weak, mark, mark, what weapon, oh yeah, we already read that, healing blast, and a bond, the armor smith. Alright everybody, well, I'm glad I got to show it to you, oh, let's see what this looks like. Look at all this goodness. <laughs> My nice uh, setup here. 
Alright, everyone. Well, we have quite a bit of decks. It was a fun opening up with you. And, uh, I guess next I'm going to start playing them with TCO. Alright, catch you next time. Please stay together till the end of